Hello, my friends and fellow Bedsies. It is day seven, not really, but magic of producing ahead. So I figured that I would have two different in review days. A day to review how my week has been at the end of my school week, and a day to review what the week of beds has been like. And I figured that those should be two different days. And so since it is the seventh day of beds and we have done a week of it, this made logical sense to me! And there's been lots of cool stuff going around, but the one I really wanted to respond to was Graham's video where he talked about the clock and also just filming around him for different movies and TV shows. Because, as I mentioned in the comments, I'm also in an area that gets filmed a lot. See, whenever you want to blow up a city, but you don't want to actually blow up the city that your things takes place in, you come to Cleveland. So lots and lots and lots of Cleveland, Ohio and the surrounding areas has been used for filming. You know, sometimes it's kind of subtle and only because I know certain streets, I'm like, oh yeah, Winter Soldier, I recognize that. But sometimes it's super obvious. Again, in Winter Soldier, they just use the Cleveland Art Museum as S.H.I.E.L.D. headquarters. Like, that big glass, that's just the Cleveland Art Museum. It's free to get in there. We took prom photos there. Another Marvel one, uh, the scene in Avengers where the Chitari are fighting in the bank and there's all the citizens and Captain America saves Ashley Johnson. Yes, Ashley Johnson. That was a bank in Cleveland. You'll notice I said was. It's not that they destroyed it. It's just a Heinen's now. Yeah, there's just this weird bougie Heinen's and literally like on the second and third, not the second, but like on the floors above, like there are these nice ass apartments. I mean, I assume they're nice. There's Cleveland Cavs players living in them, so they can't be, you know, complete garbage. At the very least, they're expensive. But yeah, it's like a goddamn Heinen's now. You can just walk in and be like, yep, this is a Heinen's. But it's also where they shot Avengers. One of my favorite films that has been shot in the Cleveland area is, of course, A Christmas Story. Higby's is just public square. Like, that entire area is just public square. If you've been there, you know. But we also have the house that they used for the exterior shots. That's over in Tremont. That's less than 20 minutes from where I am right now. In theory, I could go drive there. Actually, I have been there. It's really cool. They've turned it into a museum. It set up all like the house in there. Obviously they didn't use it for the interior shots, but they've recreated everything really well. And it's a really cool museum. It's like 15 bucks to get into. Really cool. We've met people from the film there. Um, when we were little, the actor who played Randy was living in the house for a year and my brother got to meet him on his first trip there. And when we went as a family, the lady elf, the you're holding up the line lady, she was there signing autographs and meeting people and that was super cool. But yeah, there's tons of things that have been filmed here. Uh, Air Force One, Spider-Man 3, lot, lots of things get shot in Cleveland. And that's just me, and I thought that you guys might appreciate that. I suppose I could drive to all of these places, but uh, yikes, that downtown parking. Uh, if I'm not going to see a show, that might be a little much. I don't think parking's too bad around the Christmas Story house, but also I don't know if that's worth any of our time. I don't know. Let me know. All right, my friends and fellow Betsy's, I will see you tomorrow.